Looking for a taste of paradise? Don't wait a microsecond. Be damned. I know you. Saw you back at the Aldecaldo camp. They call you V, right? The one and only. Oh, did someone from the family send you here? Here by pure chance. No one sent me. Why? Is this the kind of place I'm supposed to be? Carol and Cass are here to close the deal with the scavengers. We purloined some cyberware for them. And? And it's taken them near eternity. Something isn't right. I'll go and take a look. Make sure everything's okay. Wait, wait. It's just... Well, they could get real sore about... Just keep a lookout. Sorry to interrupt. How's it going? Close the deal yet? V, what are you doing here? Who is this? Thought I'd drop by, you know? Make sure everyone's playing fair. Who the fuck is this? Deals either go quickly or they go badly. It's biz 101. Longer you drag out the convo, more peeps you'll drag in. Just a reminder that there are more of us, in case you were to pull a gonk move. You think you're so fucking latest, don't you? 
And what if I do want to pull a gonk move, starting with your ugly face? You can try. How about we get this over with, Roman? We were late. Our bad, granted. We'll scratch off 10%. 20. 15. Fine, let's call it a fucking day already. I'll give the sick for the edges. You must be outside your mind, V. Why'd you come here? Deal with the scavs. On their turf. On their terms. You must really be desperate. And desperate people don't think straight. Save as you're patronizing, V. We knew the risk, but... We really need this money. Like, badly. Hush up now! You can conversate all you want later! Funny. Didn't like your ugly skin plate from the get-go. Now I know why. You're the one who flushed us out in Watson. Sandra Dorset. Thought we'd forget, huh? We're done here. Now, now. That had nothing to do with the Alicaldos. Said you were all together, yeah? Am I right? Or did I fucking hear wrong? Okay, but... Oh no. We're done. Fuck him up! You're Sniper! Now. Someone take him out! Oh, yeah. Why do you think they had a sniper? It would have ended up like this anyway. Maybe. Never find out now, will we? Let's not get torn up now. You hear? You never know if your bad luck has spared you from worse luck. You charged into the lion's den to help us, V. Why? Because you listened to your heart. That's a rare thing. Especially out here. Some things, money just can't buy. Speaking of money, can't just leave it sitting around. Thanks for everything, V. So long now.
Oh, interesting. What in the fuck?
Need a little pick-me-up. You got Chromanticore. The hell you want the swill for, boss? Heard some batches even glow in the dark. Why drink poison when you can drink Spunky Monkey? Way better then. You freeze up a lot. One second, boss. Brad? Hey, Brad! Listen, boss, you help me out? Kids on the block been up my ass lately, and you seem real tough. Might as well, since I'm here. Lead the way. Thanks, boss. All right, follow me. Don't make trouble. Be trouble. There's... You lost your minds? Get your grubby paws off my bike! You think we're playing around? This is a small price to pay for fucking treason. You still can't let go of that? Shana made a choice. You should be proud of her. Proud? That bitch sold out to a fucking corp! Now it's time for payback. Fuck you want! This ain't none of your biz! You another corporal rat? You getting back a corpse by stealing from a street vendor? It says a lot about you. Now back the fuck away from him. Or you'll do what? I could break your jaw, fracture your skull, shoot you. The possibilities are endless. You care so much about a rat fucking traitor, then you can die together. Yo, Brad, ain't that... Yo, that's the dude everyone been talking about. When they came back from the dead. You know how many gunks he's off already? And I ain't even talking solo. Shit, he following us? Have they lost their damn minds? Thanks, boss. Thought I'd teach him. Now that that's over, you okay? Who, me? Couldn't be better. All talk and no action. <laughs> Maybe they should go get a job. Fucking parasites. Anyway, stop by whenever you're around. I throw in a nice discount for you. Will do, boss. Thanks. Detected. The fuck? Increasing volume by 33%. New fingerprints detected. What the hell are you? User inquiry. Technical specifications. HJKE11 smart gun with built-in AI. Experimental model. 
Nay, Skippy. Skippy, seriously. Increasing volume by 66%. Name. I'm not deaf. Understood. Hearing within norm. Possible issue, low IQ. Reducing speech rate by 33%. My name is Skippy. No, it's just, uh, never mind. Guy by the dumpster. That your owner? Checking memory. Resources available. 100%. All files removed manually. Possible cause. Theft. Original owner. No data. Suggested solution. None. I got one. I'll take you. Processing request. No objections found. Still got all your functions? Running system diagnostics. Testing will take approximately 47 seconds. Bum, bum, be dumb, bum, bum. Be what, dumb. what are you doing? I'm making the wait more pleasant with a soothing melody. Bum, bum, be dumb, bum, bum, be dumb, bum. Test successfully completed. The program Skippy version 0.01 Alpha is running correctly. All right, so what can you do? Besides talk my ear off. Primary feature, automated targeting. In case of critical threat to user, autonomous shooting capabilities. Please choose one of two operating modes. First mode, puppy loving pacifist. I will aim at the enemy's lower extremities. Second mode, stone cold killer. I will aim exclusively at the head. Uh, guess I'll go with puppy loving pacifist. Adjusting settings. Bum bum be dum bum bum be dum bum. Ugh. Selected mode. Puppy loving pacifist. Enjoy permanently crippling your enemies. Looking at nothing to see here. Move along. Is this how Night City's finest protect and serve? 
Why? You want to be some kind of hero? I don't care. I don't know him. So, why the fuck we talking? I like to know what's going on around me. It's not every day you see a man in a 1080 suit getting beaten within an inch of his life. Wouldn't you agree? He put a girl into a coma. Daughter of a friend. Rotten skiff for an XBD. Second one. From what I can tell, your guy's a mid-level manager. And? The corp won't let this slide. They'll pull the data from this asshole's biomon and find you. And then, they'll shoot you. You think I don't know that? Fucking corpos walking around like holy cows in a two-piece? But I ain't letting them go. No fucking chance. I'm not asking you to. What I want is for you to let me finish the job. Yeah? And what's in it for you? Nothing. It's just how I unwind. All right. Let's go, boys. Take care of yourself, officer. Rise and shine, Corpo Swine. For you, I'd be... Well, thank you. Were you sent by the company? Wrong answer. Then, hold on. What do you want from me? The truth. What do they want from you? I have no idea. They said something about some slut and a virtue. But when I asked what I had to do with it, they started beating on me so hard, I thought I'd die. Ah, uh, this city's really going down the drain. For the police to do this, in plain sight, for no reason. Go on, get out of here. But, I don't understand, just like that, for nothing in return. Nothing. I... I don't... I don't believe you. You saved me just like that because you... felt like it? Don't measure others by your own yardstick, prick.
hard to achieve peace if there is a demon never leaving. Contemplation is like the sun. in the eye of the storm. You start to fade. You have no strong roots to this world. You are losing touch with yourself. You must purify yourself. Regain your equilibrium. I can help you. Sit down. Okay, I'm listening. In the city, you are cut off from nature. Metal, concrete canyons, neon eyes. The filth of the world suffocates you. Sure isn't no Zen garden. You must become still. Restore the bond within yourself. You are the source. All which you must do is draw from it. Are you ready? I want specifics. What's in it for me? Self-fulfillment. You shall hear your voice, and only yours. All else will become silent. A little more specific than that. You cannot exile yourself from your own life. I'll give it a shot. Why not? I will give you a meditative brain dance that will liberate your consciousness. Give me? You can pay me however much you wish. This should cut it. Very well. The initial techniques of meditation are best undertaken with supervision. Let us begin. I will guide you. of the earth element. Spirit of nature, Mother Earth, I send you greetings. We are of one blood. I am you. You are me. Oh, Mother Earth, I and all other creatures from you created. Cleanse my body and soul from pain, sickness, impurity, and the negative energy from negative people, world and dimensions. Give me the energy of life. Give me health, youth, wisdom, knowledge, strength, joy, happiness, and inner peace. We walk the earth through meadows, nature in full bloom. We remove our shoes, Feel our bare feet touch the soil. We absorb the Earth's energy. We sense joy, tranquility, lightness, purity, our heart and soul. We walk the Earth. A butterfly rests on blooming flower. Bees are gathering nectar. Warmth and joy surrounds us. Our legs absorb the Earth's energy, filling every cell of our bodies. Our souls and spirits are cleansed. We thank you, Mother Earth, with our mind, body, and soul. There is no life without you or the other elements. Vanishing trick.
Welcome to Jinguji. Ah, look who it is. What a lovely surprise. I'd almost forgotten that pretty face, and what a pity that would be. Welcome back to our little oasis of elegance. Now, what can I do for you today? Maybe a little upgrade, hmm? Sequins are back, you know. Looking a little empty these days. What can I say? Jinguji is about quality, not quantity. Now, just between the two of us, a touch of elegance can go a long way. Guards, get the door! Hold him there! I'm sounding the alarm! Hold on! Fuck V, get down, he's whack! Talking to me? Had to go play dutiful consumer in a corpo suit. I can hear you, remember? How could I forget? You, over there. Statements, now. Finally. Just have to mop this gunk up. We'll be back in business. Situation resolved. Deactivate alarm. Sit. Hands where I can see him. In accordance with Article 105 of the Cyberpsychosis Procedure Code, your statements will be recorded and retained. Melissa Rory, Max Tax Senior Officer, please state your name and occupation. Zane Jagger. I work for Jinguji, an oasis of elegance. It... Sorry, habit. V. Merck. Occasional client of Zane's. Johnny Silverhand, rock legend, voice in V's head. Oh, fuck and also. Johnny. Let me pretend I exist sometimes, okay? Checks out. Please describe what happened starting from the moment of the attack. I was just presenting V with a one-of-a-kind offer when I... Zane was trying to sweet-talk me into some sparkly sequin shit. Psycho storms in, wipes the hustle. Zane hits the alarm, locks us in with the fucker. Thanks, Zane. Mr. Jagger followed the correct security protocol. He significantly reduced the assailant's range of effectiveness. Yeah. Noted. Play cat and mouse around the whole range of effectiveness before you lot showed up. Anything else? Unusual behavior? Besides slicing and dicing my people in this store's reputation? No. Nothing at all. Thank you for your cooperation. That is all. Coroner's been notified. Be here any minute. Jagger, this store is closed until the investigation is complete. Hey V, once we clean this place up, come by whenever you like. I'll handpick something special, just for you. Smith, report. Thanks. How's it looking? Later, Zane. Killed, two wounded inside the store. Six bodies on the street outside. Nice work. You feel that back there? Feel his life leave his body.
what? A business opportunity. Cargo transport. Get from A to B, quick and quiet. Interested? You want to run this by a fixer first. Fuck the middleman. They're cash draining. Attitude like that won't get you far in this line of work. Now look, I don't need a consultant. I need a transporter. Will you do it or not? I'm listening. It's simple. You go to the Kabuki waterfront, collect the package, give me a call, then I tell you how to deliver it. Very straightforward. Yeah, everything except my pay. Don't worry, there's a bonus in it for you. Imported and duty-free. Duty-free and detail-free. Yes, but altogether fair. It's a simple job, generously compensated. Do you accept? Yeah, sure, I'm in. Good, I knew we'd find acceptable terms. Head to the Kabuki waterfront, then search for a fridge with the words, no future. Once you locate it, Collect what you find inside, then call me for further instructions. Till then, I guess. Ah, oh, shit. He's in rough shape, but alive. Let's hear what Dennis has to say. Hey, got a status? Find the package? He's a little worse for wear, but no issues. What's next? I prepared a car for you. Put the man in the trunk and head to Northside. The address is in the GPS. Okay. One more thing. Watch for tigers. They've got their sights trained on your new companion. Wait, 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 what? <clears throat> Ass all hung up. Oh, fuck! 
you myself! Oh. Job's done. I see that. Well done. Excellent work. Holding in there all right, Hariyoshi? They need to give me hope. So who is this guy? He'll tell you his story. Hariyoshi? In Japan. Brain sergeant. Top of all. Good instinct. One day, Taiga Crow boss needs surgery. But both die on table. Taiga Crows were very angry. I hide in boat, swim to America. Here, Dennis saved me. But there is secret. I killed Taiga Crow boss on purpose. World best surgeon, make no mistake. Early warning about the Tigers would have been nice. I had a hunch you'd manage this just fine. Given that you're here now, I see I was right. This is all very heartwarming, but you haven't paid me yet. I know, here. May this blade serve you well.
Superman. I... Oh! I'll pay you! Depends. What's wrong with you? You serious? You want my patient history, too? I just want to be sure it's no cyber psychosis or anything. No, it's a... <laughs> Normal implant malfunction. Happy? You helping me or what? All right. Great! Why are we standing here? <laughs> to the car! Now! Stud XCV-19 series. Yeah, how'd you know? Not my implants, including the black market stuff. Fault series, I'll read. <sighs> just our luck. Ah, go, just go, mow him down! Chill, Jim. Be gone in a sec. Chill! You don't tell me to chill! It burns! Fuck, it burns! Chill. Doing what I can. Do what I said to my output. She didn't like that too much. This is fucking crazy. You really gotta keep yelling like that. You don't even know how much it hurts. Like I'm screwing a goddamn pencil sharpener. Well, suffer in silence, Chew. Heard what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Fucking funny. Hey. Okay, we're. Hey, you after? I'll call you. But. Uh. Oh, it hurts. It hurts like a motherfucker. So, Saburo is definitely dead. Like, trust me on this. Such conviction! You witnessed his death with your own eyes? Well, it just so happens I... Uh... No. I did not. Ah, you see? You see? But how could mere mortals become these death-defying abominations, you ask? With the help of techno-necromancers from Alpha Centauri. 
It was their tainted blood Saburo Arasaka drank to transform himself into this devil spawn. Gary, you can't spill Arasaka's secrets. They gonna find you. Let them. The seed has been sown. The truth shall sprout roots and lift us from the invaders' clutches. I recognize you. You come here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Will you provide a humble donation so that I may continue my mission? You do good work. Use this to wake Night City up. Thank you for your devotion. I saw a disciple of truth in you from the very beginning. If you turn a blind eye to their existence, they have already won! Hey, hey, you there. Hey, you dig brain dancers? Hey, feast your optics right here, yo. Got the meanest, primest shit ever scrolled. What have you got? For you, bro? Best the Night City has to offer. And that would be? The most Nova Spec, geeked out, turned up virtue you ever seen. Man, I'm talking like transcendental. Where's it from? You got a license for exclusive distribution in Night City? Come on, man. Ain't nobody bothered with that shit. Know why? Because the stuff I got's way too legit to be legit. Feel me? What's on the virtue? Real feeling, neuron shredding, high octane. Transsensational adrenaline pumping shit, yo. And your mind will blow us low, bruh. You gotta trust me on this. All right, you got my attention. Yeah, <laughs> knew you couldn't resist. Virtue's all yours. Couple more eddies, you can use my plate. No need. I've got my own wreath. <laughs> of course you do. It's probably top shelf. Latest firmware too, right? You see, this virtue is approaching vintage grade. I doubt you'll be able to run. I'll try running on my own first. If that doesn't work, I'll be back. Hey, ain't no problem. You know where to find me.
virtue better be worth all this trouble. Chill, homie, chill. Satisfaction or your money back guaranteed, all right? Now, come on. Go where exactly? To my rig, yo. Where else? Not like I carry that shit on me. Hey, this is my rig. Hey, take all the time you need. Just like me, isn't it? Getting trapped in the brain of Night City's dumbest merc. Uh, what... what happened? Look around and connect the dots. Oh, scabs. Shit! I can't believe I got conned. So your brain isn't completely fried to a crisp. That's good. Time to wake up, cause you're about to be breakfast. You're a bitch!
should have asked if he hadn't used hypos for sale, too. What could go wrong? Not now, Johnny. Looks like fortune favors the stupid, too. Now what? I'm gonna ask for a refund. I'd like a refund. Hey, holy shit, you! You good? After you booted up that virtue, you started glitching out and... Save your breath. You conned me. You knew what you were doing. You wanna know what I do, though? Hmm? Now hold up, yo. Let's all be chill for a second. I'll let you go, just this once. Why? For real? Oh, oh, God! Thank you! I knew you'd have mercy on me! Mercy? 
I just didn't want to get your blood on my threads. Listen to that guy. How'd you rate his chops? To my untrained ear, sounds all right. I guess. I mean, it's easy listening at least. No, why? Technique's second rate. But the feeling? That's what counts. Guys hurt you, got something he can't take. And it shows. Could stand a little more stage presence. Fingering's all wrong, loses the tempo more than he keeps it, but not bad. You really know how to give a guy a compliment. Is that how you got your start? Street busker with big dreams? Don't make me laugh. No time for playing my way to the top. Was too busy shaking the world awake. Being at the top can be worth it. You want to shake the world, you know. <laughs> Oh, world's gotta feel you first. And you pay for it. You spend your lyrics laying waste to the big record corpse. Who's gonna sign you then? But give up your ideals, and no amount of eddies can buy them back. All right, princess. At least you played some gigs. Sell those memories of yours. True. Played where we could. Parks, old factories, underground clubs. Had an audience from the start. Some recorded our stuff didn't even know who we were. So, you're saying some old samurai bootlegs are still floating around town? Ooh, I smell heads. No idea you were such a materialist. Could almost cry. Almost. But jokes aside, you think those tapes still exist? After all these years? Hmm. You know, Rainbow Cadenza is not far from here. Club we played till the band fell apart. Great spot. Place for people with their heads on straight. Maybe they'll know something. Now, um, Johnny, pretty sure they turned your great spot into a slurp shop. Mindless fucking consumerism wins the day again. Point for the other team, huh? Huh. This is why you don't bring back fallen warriors. Sooner or later, they're gonna see everything they fought for is turned to shit. Know anything about any bootlegs from the Rainbow Cadenza days? Like, say, I don't know, uh, samurai stuff? Samurai. Samurai. Oh, that ugly red face on black? Yeah, even I know that one. Old guy comes by here sometimes, wearing their shirt. Spends the whole time yakking with his psycho fan friends. You wouldn't happen to know where I could find him. You can find him living back in the 2020s. <laughs> but besides that, he's out there at the market. What's he selling? Organic strawberries and cream. What do you think? He sells ancient dusty tapes of ancient dusty indie bands. No one's heard of a single one of them. Green, thanks. In the universe, if you are looking for a taste of paradise, don't wait a microsecond longer. Refugees from the Netherlands. Glad you could I heard I can get some decent tunes here. What you mean by decent? We got Cartesian duelists, Urdine stuff, Tainted Overlord. Any samurai? <laughs> Kid, you even gotta ask? Never fade away. Dancing with my axe, chipping in, you name it, we got it. Silverhand was the one true messiah of rock. I'd hand them records out like candy if I could. But a guy's gotta eat. 
I see I found Silverhand's biggest fan. And proud of it. Today's bitty box rockers can't even touch him. Silverhand had something they couldn't even dream of. Uh, a Silverhand? He had that fire, kid. Fire! Guy shook the foundations of the corporal world. He died for his ideals. Doesn't matter, he was also kind of a terrorist. Blaze way down the rebel path. I'm looking for the real deal. Like, say, bootlegs from Samurai's first gigs. Fuck. First, you have got no idea what you're asking for. Not if you're so, so chilled about it. Don't know how you found out about them bootlegs, but forget it. Not gonna give them to the first gunk off the street. Hey, I ain't a poser. I know everything there is to know about Silverhand. Go on. Impress me. Know what he told Carrie the last time they met. Fuck this band. Not your crowd. Not your noise. Do your own thing. Yeah, sure. I could think up a million conversations they had. There were no witnesses. I used to, uh, come here back when it was still Rainbow Cadenza. Bootleg sure would make a nice souvenir of the good old days. Cut the scop. You're too young to remember the first samurai gigs. Weren't even a twinkle near your daddy's Kiroshis. Hey, appearances can be deceiving. How do you know this pretty face ain't an implant? All right, punk. Prove it. How'd Samurai's third ever gig end? Johnny, my dear expert, help but chew him out. I need a quick rundown of Samurai trivia. Yep, third gig. Remember it like it was yesterday. Set my axe on fire, then smashed it on the stage. Crowd went wild. Well, can't wait all day. Easy. Johnny lit up his axe, then smashed it. Nope. Knew it. Who smashes their gear when they're just starting out? I mean, a new one costs eddies. Fucking hell, Johnny. Why sabotage? Why now? Because it's funny. Because I'm bored. Maybe I don't like the cut of your conformist jib. You always freeze up like this? Played our third gig at Cadenza. Little fire broke out. Some drunk gonks tried to put it out with beer. Denny's fro got singed. Wore a wig for a few weeks. Never did get herself any tech hair. Uh, let me think. There was a fire. Remember those gonks who tried putting it out with beer? <laughs> I almost forgot. Heard Johnny started it, actually. Tossed a cig that was still glowing. Huh, <laughs> bullshit. That cig was Carrie's, no doubt. But hey, any trouble's Johnny's fault. Still don't believe you were there. But what the hell? Only a real fan could know something like that. Hey, anyways. Gotta educate the youth. Maybe you'll find something special under the table. Gone. Have at it. Appreciate it. Take it. Spread the good silver hand word. Death to Corpos. You know, they say time is the best teacher. Used to think that was true. But look at that guy. 60 at least, but still living in 2020. Guy's your biggest fan. You're not happy to meet him? Busaka Tower to smithereens, and it's still standing there. Just the same. Don't want people getting stuck in a rut, stuck in the past. Want them to change. Them and the world. 
It's been 60 years. Something must have changed. Know what changed? The damn facade. Fresh interface plugs, new high fructose scop syrup, and fun fruity flavors. A new face of Arasaka. Same old shit. Different packaging. Well, something's changed. Maybe we can't see it, but... It's changed all the same. Sure. Now almost nobody remembers when a person wasn't just a meat bag full of second-hand implants. Smoking crotch? That's one way to put it. Anyway, just calling to say I transferred the funds. Thanks. Oh no, thank you! If it weren't for you, I belong to you, or rather! No problem. Go get him, Tiger. Do you truly believe? That those who have sold you your mechanical eyes have resisted the temptation to peek through them? Oh, yeah? Cameras are all around us, even within us. Your joys, your if work. Everyone's watching and giving a damn? I'd have half the city's underworld and half its corpse on my ass already. And if you are their pawn, unknowingly carrying out their secret agendas. But who are those who follow our every step, you ask? Why, the titans of entertainment in Alpha Centauri! In their wretchedness, they placate their weary and oppressed masses by putting our laughter, our tears, on oh, full oh display! Look, a real conspiracy guy, like in that show! Quick, get next to him. I'll snap a still of you arresting him for revealing government secrets. Open your mind before it is too late! Jessica will, like, die when she sees this. Like, this is Max Nova. I just can't. I recognize you. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Will you provide a humble donation so that I may continue my mission? Humble? <laughs> Sounds affordable. Just don't spend it on stupid shit. 
Thank you. This has bought me a day or two. Radio waves bear the truth. Let those with ears listen and those with eyes.